Okay, guys, we're back at the Hound Pits pub where we need to confront the loyalists. But first, we need to save Piero and um, Sokolov. Um, I don't know how I want to do this yet, though. I don't know if I want to do it all myself or end the siege on Piero's Welsh and, so, so, and ensure the safety of the two natural philosophers within. Okay, I definitely want to retrieve the blueprint from Havelock's bedroom. Um, but I want to end the siege as well. So I think I should, I'm going to do that before I enter the building because I don't want to accidentally, you know, have the game skip me forward, you know, and lock me out. So yeah, let's, let's end this siege. Let's see if we can take down this guy. I can't do drop assassinations. I don't know. I just, I can never get them right. Um <laughs> Alright, where am I gonna put you? Hmm. Is there anything in here? Can we even go in here? Shit. We need the Emily's tower key needed. Okay. I'm gonna take this guy out. God, those tall boys sound so much closer than they actually are. Um, did I get rid of all of them from here? There's grenades, there's a elixir of some sort there. Yes. Alright. Okay. The tall boy. Alright. Um, how can we... Because I did kill one. We did, we did kill one in the last video. But right, we can go in through here. Um, I'm going to take this tall Attention boy out. Attention Dunwall citizen. Shit. Hiram Burroughs, formerly the Lord Regent, has confessed to heinous crimes against the people of Dunwall. He shall be confined to the Coldridge prison until the proper authorities decide his sentence. Can I please get up? I, Admiral Farley Havelock, humbly accept the mantle of Lord Regent of the State of Crystal and all of its imperial possessions, notably the capital city of Dunwall. I fervently hope my tenure will be a short one and that the rightful heir will take her place within a mere decade or so. Shut up, Havelock, as if you would let that happen. I forgot to say as well, um, the the game you know how the game glitched um in the the mission where i had to take out the lord region it glitched i didn't get to hear his confession i looked it up i heard it i know he caused the plague it was really really fucked up yeah so i heard all that yeah crazy i don't know like how do I have to be stealthy? I'm worried that if I alert them, Havelock is just going to come out. And I don't want that, you know? I want to... I want to I want to do it properly. I want to go in. I want to get his key. And I want to confront him one-on-one. -on -one. Alright. Um, I'm going to put them all to sleep. Not the tall boys, obviously. I really don't think they'll be able. Alright, there you go. Let's flush him out. How do you know? How can you s Alright, um Alright. What? Alright, so I'm guessing that worked. Is there anyone else? Did that work? Yes, it worked. Okay. Alright, there's another one. I know you're here. I know you're here. Alright. I mean, I'm not killing you, you know, you 
speak, right? Oh. Oh shit, what? Oh my god. No, please don't. Yeah. This is the first time I'm using the mask as well. Um, is there anyone else? Just tall boys? Let's... Mm, I want to grenade them, maybe. Don't come over here. I need to keep an eye on this door. Bombing these tall boys. <coughs> ah, wrong button. Is that even doing anything? Probably not. Fuck. All right. Um. So they are out here. No, they're not. They're in there. Okay. Oh no, that's Sucklove and Piero. Ugh. Is this the one we've already... Is not liking the, the one? look of this one bit. Ugh. That party died down inside awful fast. And now they called all the staff together. They said one more package for me to deliver. But I think I'll be keeping station at a safe distance from the riverbank and keep an eye on things for a while. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. Fucking hell. Wallace. Shit. 
My dear Wallace, you are departing for a safe and secure place where we can coordinate the transition of power to ourselves. Make certain that my audiograph and the best of the wines make it aboard the vessel before the sun sets. This evening, the staff will be rewarded for their loyalty and service, Lord Pendleton. Is he that sick that he just gave him that just because... Or did he not know? They are sick, they are, because when we were at the pub, when we were celebrating, they were saying things like, oh, go in, collect yourself, get some gear. They were, like, talking to us, like, the, you know, like about our future and everything. That is so messed up. But, look, I would assume that Lord Pendleton did know and was in cahoots with all this. That's just so fucked up. Callista, read. Callista, fret not. I believe there is still hope for Emily and Dunwall. I don't believe Corvo is gone. I'll be searching the river for him, but if you catch wind of him, shoot up a flare using a launcher I placed in Emily's tower, and I'll make my way back as soon as I can. Keep this tower locked and take care of yourself. Emily's gonna need you when this is over, Samuel. Emily Tower Key, yes. Oh, that's so fucked up. Only a few watchmen remain standing. Okay. Hidden forever. Hey, wake up. Hear me? Shit. Oh my god. Alright. Alright, I want to get this. I want to get this. Yes. Yes. Jed will notice. Beyond watch for members of the conspiracy. Some are still at large. If discovered, they are to be killed on sight. Move the bodies into the kennel, but they are not to be otherwise tampered with. What the f- Okay. Pero Joplin, missing. Interrogate, when, then execute. Anton Soklov, missing. Interrogate, then execute. Lydia Brooklane, found dead. Wallace Higgins, found dead. Callista Corno, found dead. Corvo Atano, believed dead. Assume, missing. Kill on sight. Samuel Beechworth, missing. Kill on sight. Put the corpses in bags and keep them in the backyard. Do not disturb or search the bodies in any other way. Why? Lord Regent Havelock. Use the flip. Use the flare launcher in Emily's tower to signal Samuel. Okay, you return to the Houndpits pub to pick up the trail. Okay. So when we're done, we can signal him. Alright, sleep darts, spring, grenades, alright. I don't know if anyone will hear this. The others took Emily away in a boat. I don't know where and her hair hadn't been combed yet. I worry who will look after her. I didn't even get a chance to say goodbye. Okay. Okay, this is our room here. All right. All right, let's slow down time. Let's stop time. Remember before when I mentioned a special drawing I was working on for you? This is it. I don't know where you went, but I hope when you get back you see this and like it. I'd like to take it to Dunwall Tower with us. Everyone's acting strange tonight. Samuel was whispering to Callista about a flare launcher that she was supposed to use to call him. 
He told her to lock the door to my old tower. I heard the Admiral tell the others we are leaving tonight for a place called the Lighthouse in Kingsborough Island. I hope you get back before then, Emily. Alright. Find Emily. Yeah. Okay, so we know where she is now. Emily, what the fuck? <laughs> Uh. Here are the blueprints. Astonishing. The arc pylon is complete. Now to activate it. With this device, we can send a powerful electrical signal through the nervous system, merely rendering our enemies unconscious, or they can be reduced to ashes. What is your opinion, Corvo? Burn them, Piero. Put them all to sleep. As you wish, Corvo. We will be far away before any of them regain their senses. All is ready, Corvo. All that remains is plugging in a whale oil tank to power up. Will you do the honors? Yeah, right. When this arc pylon is charged, no one will dare come near us. beyond my greatest expectations. Sorry. All city watchmen have been eliminated. The siege has ended. Awesome. It defies description. A device like this will ensure Dunwall's security for a century. Well, Corvo, I hope we can be considered colleagues again. You were condemned. I was kidnapped. Men like us rise above such things. <laughs> as to the good Admiral, I believe men such as Havelock start with high-minded intentions. Same with Martin, and maybe even Pendleton, though I suspect he was just lazy. But no one is prepared for the sheer seductive influence of being so close to real power. Once you start ordering people killed to get your way, Everything else is mere detail. Mm. I return to my work now, and you to yours. Killing people, I mean. I sincerely hope it goes well. I try not to kill people. This Piero of yours, a strange mind. But then my own is strange as well. If there is a cure to the plague, I believe we will find it. The old Empress would have liked that. She was a strange one. Stranger, I think, than you ever knew. But such things are past. And this new Empress, she's a strange one too. Mm. I wish you peace, Corvo, along with all the delights you can wring from the world. We once discussed a system of signals to be used in Emily's tower for communication across the river. I wonder if he remembers that. What can I make for you? This may be the last time. Anything? All right, um... 600 dollars. Yeah, I think we're better off getting resources. Yeah. Better off getting resources. Alright. Any upgrades that cost a hundred bucks? No. Goodbye, Piero. Goodbye, Corvo. I wish to apologize for what was done to you. It seems that holding all the pieces and standing a step from the throne changed something in the others. Something I don't understand. Don't 
underestimate Havelock, Corvo. Mm. He'll be waiting. Yeah. Captain Manning, we've tracked the conspiracy to the Hounds Pit pub. Search the premises for the natural philosophers Piero Joplin and Anton Sokolov. Do what you must to secure all materials related to the enhanced arc pylon they have been, they have been constructing. Question them thoroughly, and once you are certain you have everything they know of the pylon, execute them both. Bring the pylon to me, along with his papers and recordings. They may be two of the greatest minds of our age, but they're also traitors and conspired with Corvo to bring down this empire. I'm keeping Empress Emily Caldwin with me at the lighthouse in King on King Sparrow, King Sparrow Island, until we're certain that Corvo and his fellow conspirators have been properly dealt with. Lord Regent have Regent Havelock. Okay, let's go talk to Cecilia again. Oh shit. A letter from Cecilia. Corvo, I'm going to make a run for it. I think that if I hadn't met you, I wouldn't be brave enough to try. I'll try to find you again. Someday when this is all over, Cecilia. Alright. Ooh. Really? Oh yeah, I bought some. Alright. Let's use this one and pick that one. Alright. Awesome. I really hope she made it. Let's see if we can find her body anywhere. Alright, let's signal Samuel. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Hi Samuel. Thought I'd find you here. Never pays to bet against you, does it? I saw the signal. I knew you'd be back, Corvo. I knew it. We should start off soon. I've been feeling something in my bones, and if it's plague, well, I can't be counted on to drive this boat much longer. No. We're going to King's King Sparrow Island. Where that that's where they've taken Emily. Wait here. Yeah, let's go. Good. Then it's one more trip across the river to where it meets the sea. That's where the Lord Regent was building his new lighthouse. Ought to be something to see. Civilians killed zero. Whoop whoop. Chaos high. A apparently chaos is cumulative. So there's no hope for me. We we're stuck with high chaos, even though we didn't kill anyone on in this mission. Yeah, we killed five hostiles. No alarms rung. Never did we we were detected apparently. Find the arc pylon to rescue. Use use the arc pylon to rescue Pierre and Sokolov. Found Emily's drawing. One rune, one of one rune found, zero of zero bone charms, zero of zero outsider shrines, no paintings, um, 150 coins out of 360. Where were the coins? I looked everywhere. Okay, apparently not. The leaders of the loyalist conspiracy have moved it to a monumental lighthouse, the final military project devised by the Lord Regent. They're holding Emily as they struggle to tighten their hold over the city. It's time to confront them, decide their fates, and determine the future of Dunwall. Dunwall. I think I'm gonna kill them. The island is a bloody mess. Looks like they fought. Maybe over Emily. Just after they landed. I bet the animals got her locked up in the lighthouse somewhere. Hamilton's lost the first round. He's probably dug in someplace, doing his best to drink himself to death. I suspect it's Martin who's got the lighthouse under siege. They turned on each other at last. So the Admiral's power mad, Martin's a snake. Yeah, and no Lord shit. Lord Hamilton is a coward. Well, he's and not a you. soldier. I'm a little disappointed, Corvo. It's like you've gone out of your way to be brutal. It's been interesting traveling with you. But this is the last time you'll see me, sir. Goodbye. My only hope is that Emily comes out of this all right. Out, Corvo. I'll 
let you go this once. What do you mean you'll let me go this once? Wow, what a change of attitude. <laughs> Reach the lighthouse, enter King Sparrow Fort, optional. Yes, we're going to find Pendleton and we're going to find Martin. Okay, Samuel doesn't like us. Area map. Okay. Why wouldn't it let me go up here? Maybe from up here? Yes. You know what? Let's rewire it. We're high chaos anyway. Let's just do it. <laughs> Your little music box won't save you, mate. When I find you, it's going to be bad. Are you gonna get him, pal? <laughs> really? I don't think, I think I'm going to die going here, but I'm going to try to quickly go in and get the door. No. <laughs> Going for chaos rewire. We're embracing it, you know. We can't we can't turn this shit back now, so we may as well embrace it. A few moments later. Shit. What now? It's not their fault, you know, they're just they're just following orders. No, I don't really wanna if I can spare them, I would like to, you know. It's not the best you can do. You disappoint me, Martin! Why don't you come down and settle this man to man? The view is nice up here. I'm not moving! Don't try to act brave, you worthless piece of inbred shit. Come and get me if you're so strong! Stupid blue blood. Let's see how you like this. You couldn't hit me if I was standing next to you. <laughs> now I'll sit for a while and consider the problem of getting into the gatehouse. I need time alone. Mom Pendleton. That bastard stuck me in. I should have killed them all when I had the chance. Don't say that, my lord. First my brothers, now me. It's my own fault. And now cousin Celia's going to inherit. That's the worst of it. <laughs> You've been a decent cat. A little slow on the draw yesterday, I have to say. But decent. Yes, my lord. Sorry, my lord. Yeah. <coughs> well, you're too late. I'm already dying without your help. A stray bullet. I'll never know whose. What could I offer you anyway? You want money? Well, I'm broke. Women, maybe? Everyone knows you were screwing the Empress. You like noble women. You should meet my cousin Celia. <laughs> I want no one involved with you, bitch. Uh. I 
wish I'd said goodbye to my kids, but I didn't know. I thought we'd already won. I still say his lordship was right to try for the girl. The Admiral was just faster. His lordship's landed us right in the shit now. You're right there. Havlik up top, Martin at the gates, Nelson in the middle. And our man's wounded. Shut your mouths, both of you. We're Pendleton's men. Live or die, we're going to act like it. All right, Martin, you snake. Ooh. Hi, bitch. Here to add me to your list? To write my name across the ground in blood? I'm not gonna plead innocence. When we dug you out of Cold Ridge Prison, we had the best of intentions. We'd find Emily and strike against the Lord Regent. But once we started ordering deaths, blackmailing those in power, and all the other things you're not supposed to do, well, I guess it just became a habit. It's a hard thing holding the keys to the Empire in your hands. Oh my god. It weighs on a man's mind heavily. Yeah, right. No, you just want to power. Curse Havelock and Pendleton as fools. Curse me as well. I can't stop you from going after Emily, but I'm not going to give you the privilege. I was born into nothing, and it's nothing I'll return to. Coward. Guards, to me! Alright, I'll abate it here. The lighthouse, excerpt from a recent historical work on King Sparrow Island. King Sparrow Island sits in the middle of the Renhaven River and up through the previous century up and up through the previous century it was only used by fishermen and for occasional religious ceremonies. During the time of the Morley insurrection, a fort and naval dock were added to the island as a means of protecting the city from attacks by sea. In the time of the Rat Plague Crisis, shortly after the tragic tragic death of Empress Jasmine Coldwen, Dunwall's acting regent Hiram Burroughs commissioned the construction of a modernised military instalment and lighthouse on the island. Burroughs lighthouse only recently completed is widely considered to be one of the marvels of the modern age, humming with Sokolov's technologies powered by processed whale oil. Do you have anything? Yes. Control room key. Elevator key. No more sleep darts. Did you gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Never doubt it. Enter the lighthouse elevator. Look this. Finally! One of one. We should be able to afford something now. Um, is it even worth it though, really? No, I think we'll just go Vitality. Yeah, let's upgrade our vitality and that will be all of our powers upgraded. Yeah. That was the plan anyway, to upgrade vitality and then maybe get something new. So, but we're good, we're good. Stop me. Firing. 
go to Burroughs Lighthouse. 